part of Quincy has been called dangerous, and now the city is taking action. Good evening, I'm Mackenzie Henderson. And I'm Dylan Austin. Some changes are coming to the crosswalk in front of Quincy Medical Group after workers and patients report nearly getting hit by cars. And WGEM's Rebecca Duffy is live in Quincy with more information on that. Rebecca. Dylan and Mackenzie, this crosswalk in front of QMG on Main Street is going to be getting some new signs that'll tell drivers to slow down for pedestrians. And those who use the crosswalk say it's long overdue. Payson resident Dakota Epley frequently takes her daughter to doctor's appointments at QMG. She says she sees cars driving quickly through this crosswalk on Main Street in front of the building. It's actually very concerning, especially when you've got a little kid who, you know, likes to run, run around and let go of hands. QMG employees expressed concern over drivers not yielding to pedestrians in the crosswalk. Last night, the city's traffic commission decided to add more signage to the crosswalk. I think that would be actually a very good idea, not only for pedestrians, but also for, you know, other traffic trying to pull in or out. City engineer Steve Bangie says this crosswalk is one of the busiest in Quincy and cars still blow through it. They're thinking cars are going to stop for them but then some cars do and other cars don't. So yeah, some cars do blow, blow through there and others don't. So. The new signs will tell drivers to stop for pedestrians. Illinois laws state that cars have the right of way when pedestrians are not yet in the crosswalk, but must stop for pedestrians if they are standing in the crosswalk. Quincy Patrol Officer Amber Hastings thinks the new signs will help keep more people safe. Nobody wants to get hit. We don't want to see anybody get hit and or injured. So if we can do anything to lower the numbers, it's definitely a positive thing. The city is currently in the process of ordering these signs, and they say it'll take about a month for them to be put up. Live in Quincy, Rebecca Duffy, WGEM News.